Isabella, we've mentioned that there was a light sprinkle when we were driving into work today. What do people need to know before they leave their house? Well, if you're leaving your house, I would grab an umbrella and definitely a jacket because that sprinkle we saw this morning is going to be turning into a full blown rainstorm. It's going to be very rainy today. We are actually in a storm tracker for alert day. Thanks to all of the rain we're seeing. That is the biggest story of today as well. We're tracking some rain, rain, rain. But if you're in those higher elevations and the mountains, you'll be seeing some snow. Thanks to two storm systems coming into our area the next few days. The first storm is hitting us today and that is really going to be showing the most impacts from today until tomorrow morning. We'll have a little bit of relief on Monday, but then we have a second storm system coming in that's hitting us Tuesday and that's going to be stronger. So we're going to be seeing more rain and more snow once that hits on Tuesday. But with our rain, we're tracking some valley rain. We're tracking nearly up to an inch today through tomorrow morning and then that second Tuesday storm we're tracking over an inch of rain. So by the end, once we're done seeing all these weather impacts around Wednesday into Thursday. We're going to be seeing a lot of rain well over two inches. The biggest impacts is going to be ponding and potential flooding on the road. So if you're heading out on your commute, be sure to give yourself some extra time driving. Just be weary of some um, impacts in terms of driving. But as I mentioned, if you are in those higher elevations, not only are you seeing rain, you are easily going to be seeing some snow. We are currently seeing a winter weather advisory, which is in place in the higher elevations and mountains for both Pima, Pinal, Graham and Greenlee County. That will be in effect until tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. And with that snow, we're tracking about four to nine inches of snow today into tomorrow morning from that first storm system. The second one coming on Tuesday, we're tracking eight to 12 inches of of snow. So by the end of this, we can easily see nearly 16 inches of snow. And with that, the biggest implications are going to be travel. So I do recommend calling the 511 number just to see the latest on road conditions and potential road closures. Same thing. Definitely give yourself extra time when driving. Now taking a live look out of our storm tracker for tracking clouds camera. We're seeing a lot of cloud coverage, but all the cloud coverage we're seeing coming through is green. That's all the moisture in those clouds. It's really going to be a rainy day. And the reason we're seeing this, as I mentioned, we have that first um, storm system that's hitting us today. It's bringing a lot of that green and pink. That's rain and snow. So that's what we're seeing today. And then we're seeing that other storm system coming in Tuesday. And we're really not going to see the end of those effects until late Wednesday, even into Thursday, once that finally clears out around Thursday. Current temperatures across southern Arizona, we're seeing temperatures in the 40s to 50s. Things are really not going to be warming up past that. We're definitely seeing a drop from our temperatures yesterday. Now, finally, taking a look at our 10 day tracker, 90% chance of showers today here in Tucson. It's going to be 59, a little relief on Monday, but then Tuesday, that bigger storm, we're seeing 100% of rain, and we're really not going to see any relief from the rain until Thursday.